Isn't it good to know that God was personally involved in our creation and our formation? Furthermore, we must understand that our Lord and Savior gives his personal attention to sustaining and maintaining us on a daily basis. As we praise God on today for who he is in our lives, let us thank him for all that he has done for us, no matter what we are going through on today. I want you to remember, God cares and loves each of us deeply, and he continuously and intentionally molds and makes us with intricate care and attention. So as we begin this day, let us remember that our Lord is omniscient and omnipresent. That simply lets us know that he knows everything and he is always there. And this God that knows everything and is always there values and cares for each and every one of us. So let's give God praise on today for who he is. May we pray. Gracious Heavenly Father, we come now as humbly as we know how. We thank you, Heavenly Father, for this new day that you have blessed us with. As we approach your throne, we ask you to forgive us of our sins. We ask you to forgive us of our sins of omission and our sins of commission. We ask you, Father, to create in us a clean heart and to renew a steadfast spirit within us, restoring to each of us the joy of your salvation. And as we prepare to launch out into the deep on today, we ask you to give us focus. We ask you to prepare our hearts and minds for what we are going to deal with on today. Lord, we thank you, Lord, for being personally involved in our creation and our formation. And we thank you, Father, for giving special attention to sustaining and maintaining us no matter what we endure on a daily basis. We just give you praise, Father, on today for who you are, and we thank you for the great things that you have done in our lives. And for this, Father, we will praise your holy name. We will honor you in what we say and what we do. And so, Father, as we launch out on today, we ask you to be a hedge of protection around us. We ask you, Lord, to be in the midst of our families. We ask you to protect our children, Lord. We ask you to send your healing presence into the hospitals on today. And we ask you, Father, to bless every individual that is in need on today. And we ask you to meet them where they are, Lord, and touch them with your finger of love. And we ask that your will be done in their lives. So as we prepare to go on today, put us in remembrance of who you are. Put us in remembrance that you know everything, Lord, and that you're everywhere. And we are going to give you the praise, the honor, and the glory as we go forth. Lord, we know we're not perfect beings, Lord, but we know that through you, you can do the impossible through us. So Lord, we ask you on today to simply do the impossible in our lives. We ask you to bless us and anoint us afresh as we go forth. Be with us now. Give us Holy Ghost boldness, for thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory. Forever we pray, amen, amen, amen. And remember, God is personally involved in what you are going to accomplish on today. God bless you.